Filling three buildings at the Wilson County Fairgrounds, shoppers have plenty of items to browse and buy. In its fifth year and growing, this is the annual Holiday Crafts Bazaar, organized by local family and community education, or FCE clubs, and UT Extension. If, you're, if it's on your list, it's probably here. Local artisans display crafts, some with a holiday theme and others that work in your home year-round. We do. We have all kind of crafts here. We have uh, jewelry, anything you would want to buy also for Christmas. We have handmade items and we have candy. Frances leads Wilson County FCE and soon she'll turn things over to President-elect Dorothy Dunn. Dorothy says proceeds from some items sold go back into the community. Charities like a local men's center and 4-H. FCE members are also generous with their knowledge. We need to help our fellow man. So this is a way, is a way for us to help our fellow man, you know, uh, teaching them, working with them to learn crafts. Back in the heat of August at the Wilson County Fair, the FCE Club had Christmas on the brain. Over the summer, they made more than 600 ornaments and donated them to people impacted by the Sevier County wildfires. Holiday ornaments for people who've lost so much is just one way FCE looks to help others. The organization has a history of this. You know, FCE is a grassroots organization um, started by Extension, but really has flourished over the last hundred plus years. And um, the whole thing is to give back to the community. They really believe in community service projects and bettering the community that they live in. It's often said the most thoughtful present is one where someone took the time to make it special. And whether you're shopping for gifts or making them, these crafty folks say this bazaar is a great way to get in the seasonal spirit. Merry Christmas. This is Charles Denny reporting.